So let's take a look at a practice question from a previous exam. So according to Ryerson's survey, 30% of adults in Toronto said that the cell phone is the invention that they hate most but cannot live without. Suppose the result holds true for the current population of adults in Toronto. A random sample, so we have a random sample of 80 adults, is selected. Determine the probability that A exactly 20 adults in this sample hold this uh, the said opinion and then B we have to find at most 25 adults and then at least 15 adults so first of all we know that this is a binomial distribution question because they gave us a random sample which is n equals to 80 and they gave us the success um, probability which is in this case it's, it's a binomial distribution. This is the given symbol. Uh, they give us 30%, but since it's in percentage, it cannot be 30. It has to be less than 1. Therefore, 30 divided by 100 is 0.3. So the percentage of success is 0.3. And this question cannot use Poisson distribution because it's nothing to do with amount of space or period of time. So, let's start with question A, which is exactly, they want us to find the probability that exactly 20 adults, so 20. So, using BPD on our calculator, because we have an exact number, our x is 20, our n is 80, which is the random sample, and our probability of success is 0.3 and our answer when you execute is equals to 0 0.0626 so for this question is 0 0.0626 so moving on to part B part B which asks us for at most 25 adults in this sample hold the said opinion so at most, you need to note this down on your crib sheet, that at most means less than or equal to. So at most is probability of x less than or equal to 25. And this, you simply uh, plug it into your BCD. The x will be 25, since as we said before, the formula on the BCD is probability of x less than or equal to a number. So you simply plug in 25, and then our other data remain the same. So n is 80, and p is 0.3. And our answer will be 0 0.6479. So 0 0.6479. Moving on to question C. The question is at least 15 adults, at least is probability of x greater than or equal to 15. So in this case, we've already gone through that since in BCD, this is the formula of in BCD. So in order to find probability of x greater than or equal to 15, we need to do this. 1 minus probability of, of x less than or equal to 14. So using BCD again, BCD, our x is going to be 14 and the rest of the data is the same, n is 80 and um, our p is 0.3. We get 7.9 e which uh, 0, 0.3 which like we mentioned before means 0 0.0079347 so this answer is probability of x less than or equal to 14 therefore in order to find probability of x greater than or equal to 15 we do this 1 minus the probability we just found which is 0 0.0079347 and we get 0 
So this is our answer to C, 0 0.99207.